Hi, today I'm here to help you start development with TI's RF value line parts. TI's low cost sub 1 gigahertz RF solution. So my name is Erlich Simonsen, product marketing for Texas Instruments. And with me I have Magnus Vines, tools manager for our DRF group. Hello. And uh, Magnus, uh, so if I buy a uh, value line development kit, what will I get? Then you get uh, all the hardware you can see here. You get four RF evaluation modules. One evaluation module with the value line transmitter, one with the value line receiver, and two boards with the value line transceivers. So Magnus, the antennas on the RF boards look quite interesting. Uh, what can you tell me about those? Yeah, for the RF boards, we've developed a small compact PCB antenna. And this antenna works for the 868 and 915 MHz frequency bands. So how about 433 MHz? Are those the same size? Yeah, we've also developed a small compact PCB antenna for the 433 MHz band. And you can buy a separate kit with the RF modules for, for that frequency band. Okay. So if I want to test RF performance with this setup, uh, what do I do? Well, testing RF performance with this kit is actually very easy. You just take the RF board and connect it to the development board, like this. And then you have several options for testing the RF performance. On the board, we have an MSP430, which runs a packet array test. So you can just take the board like this and run off and do range testing and actual RF performance testing. Okay. And you also have the option to use Smart RF Studio. So on the PC, you run Smart RF Studio, connect it to the USB controller on the board, and test and do actual RF performance testing. Okay. So uh, looking at these uh, evaluation boards, um, what peripherals do I have when I do application development? Well, the board is developed to make it very easy to make demo and prototype software. So the board has a large LCD screen, it has an accelerometer for lumen sensing, for instance, we have a light sensor, we have an external SPI flash, LEDs, buttons, and of course breakout headers for easy connectivity of other peripherals. That sounds good. So when you're doing development, you have Smart RF Studio to generate RF settings and uh, RF registers and so on. Yeah. Are there any other software tools that go with this uh, development kit? Yes, you can actually use this board together with our packet sniffer. So with the RF module and the development board connected to the PC, this board acts as a capture device for our packet sniffer. And of course, if you want to develop software, the kit includes the MSP430 debugger. So you just start IR Embedded Workbench or Co-Composer Studio, and then you can develop software. Okay. So to summarize, um, I would need to go out and buy the kit. I would download Smart RF Studio free of charge from the web. I would download the packet sniffer, also free. And then I would get either IR or CCS, and then I would be good to go for application development. Yes. Okay. Thank you for watching this video on the TI RF Value Line Development Kit. For more information, go to ti.com slash rfvalueline. <laughs>